Revelation 2211. From the 14th of January 1942. Last Judgment. Rapture. The last judgment will suddenly and unexpectedly come upon people, and it will slay every creature on earth, for the earth will change in itself. Everything that can be called alive will be destroyed by a blistering fire storm which will change the appearance of earth beyond recognition to people who presently inhabit it. Yet it shall be proclaimed to them since a few will be amongst them who will live on the old as well as on the new earth, and they shall testify to the miracles God performed on them. For they will experience the destruction of the old earth in the flesh and yet not be affected by it for the Lord will approach them, and he will lift them away from the earth. These few are strong in faith and devoted to God in love, they live according to God's will and are placed under tremendous pressure by those people who lack all faith. And thus they are in utmost danger and will be rescued by the Lord who will come and fetch them himself. And a separation will happen, good will be separated from evil, the faithful from the unbelievers. God will seize Satan's power over the spiritual substance by banishing it into the solid form again. And thus the earth will be shaped anew. Nothing will remain in its old form because the time has come to an end which God gave to the spiritual beings for liberation from the form. It will be a new era in the period of salvation which will be realized with surprise by the people who will be returned to this newly shaped earth in order to become the root of a new generation. They will know about the old earth and will now live on the newly shaped earth. They will recognize the greatness of God, his wisdom and omnipotence and his infinite love, for their eyes will be presented with a scene which they will absorb with amazement and reverence. It is a realm of peace, delightful and graceful to behold with a most manifold array of exceedingly charming creations, yet completely divergent from those of the old earth. And people will cheer and rejoice elatedly for having been granted the great blessing of inhabiting the new earth. And the horrors of experiencing the last judgment will fade from their minds, even though it had not affected them for God will let the event that brings destruction to everything living on earth happen before their eyes, yet they will emerge from it unscathed because God will move them in the flesh to a place of peace until he has accomplished the work of reshaping and then he will return them to earth again. Then love, peace and harmony will unite the people who were allowed to experience this process of transformation. They will praise God give thanks to him and worship him with profound reverence, they will live according to his will and God will bless them and let a new generation come forth from them which cannot be oppressed by the adversary for a long time, because all power has been taken away from him. And this will be a time of peace and of union with God, for God will stay in their midst because love dwells within these people. Amen.